I'm John Howard with Jay Hamilton Howard Antiques. We have here a child's circus toy. Um, we're unsure of age, probably like 40s or 50s. And on the top there's instructions that say, turn two to three times, top over bottom, in direction of the pointing hand, which has a finger. Have you ever come across anything else like this? Yes, sir. It's the first time I've ever seen one like I've that. seen examples that were much rougher, the boxes, uh, when I first got it. Mm -hmm. uh, I've never seen anything like it. And so do you imagine this would have been maybe like a, a souvenir that a kid like, I think so, you could like yeah, buy yeah. at the circus yep. and like take home? Yeah, I think it's a souvenir. You think it dates back to like the 1930s, 1940s? I don't think it's that old because of the type of um, printing and color done on the backdrop. I think it's more like 40s or 50s. And I think that the, the hands made it to look a little older. And I love the graphics in the background. I do too. That's other trapeze yeah. artists. Yeah. And I like mechanical things that surprise people. Yeah. You know, somebody told me years ago, an older dealer, he said, you don't always have to make a lot of money on things that are very interesting that that you know make a new customer like eric here or you know interest people by like the masses of everybody that comes in your booth goes wow look at that and that's you know that's i'm always driven with that in mind as far as what you're going to buy you know uh, if it's really cool i don't care if i make a hundred dollars at or twenty dollar or whatever. It's a boost draw. Mm -hmm. It's it's also finding customers and people yeah. appreciate. Hey, I got that off him. You know. Yeah. Which exactly. is a cool thing.